sense is that uh, to apprise everyone, all the citizens of state of Meghalaya, that we are going to organize a taxpayers. Ka Office of Principal Commissioner Taxation Shillong, Kasorkar India, kan penlong yaka taxpayers hub, nika yo loom khajana, ban ajing shai shaki paj ba halot ki khajana ba pher ba pher. Ka nika yo khajana, kan long haka shpau tarik, hadu khat ar tarik jaliyo arja apusau, ha Shillong Club. Uba DAJ Saukumi, Uba Day U Principal Commissioner Income Tax Chilong, Ula Ong, Baka Pang Bakong San Jongayo, Kalong Ban Ajing Hikai, Baban Pan Priang Hikajing Tip, Halorka Income Tax Act. Ula Ong Rubaka Tong Bakmat Ka Program, Kalong Halorki Libenta, Kantop Yaka Education, Information But Redressal. More than 9,600 crores. That to apprise everyone, all the citizens of state of Meghale, that we are going to organize a taxpayers hub in Chilong. Now the basic motive behind uh, the learned principal commissioner of income tax, Sri D. J. Sokme sir, will be briefing you shortly in detail what all are the ingredients of this taxpayers hub. So basically, the basic intent behind this taxpayers hub is to create an awareness amongst the citizens to provide a platform to address to any grievances which the normal citizens have, and to give our services and to project a very friendly and warm. Image of the department, income tax department. Is to apprise the press that the income tax department will be holding a taxpayers hub in Shillong from the 10th to the 12th of June 2024. This taxpayer hub will be held. The location will be at the Shillong Club, and this taxpayer hub would be inaugurated by our principal, Director General of Income Tax. Shimati Archana Chaudhary. Uh, she is uh, in charge of administration and taxpayer service. And the basic objective of this taxpayers hub is to disseminate information about the Income Tax Act to the taxpayers and also to promote voluntary compliance of the Tax Act. Now, Taxpayers Hub is an unique initiative of the Directorate of Public Relations, Publication and Publicity, Central Board of Direct Taxes. Now, in this tax, uh, Taxpayers Hub, we'll be using many innovative methods to spread across this message. The Taxpayers Hub will be spread over three days. and. The operation would be on on Monday, that is the tenth, at twelve noon. It will be operated by our principal director general, Shrimati Achana Choudhury. It will be attended also by our chief commissioner of income tax, northeast region, Shrimati Chatteri Panmay, and also by the chief commissioner of income tax, Shri Shrikant Ambasta. Now, the taxpayers hub is a unique dynamic platform and its basic objectives are three. The first is education, second is information and the third is taxpayers redressal, redressal of grievances. Now as far as education is concerned, this taxpayer hub will not only educate the taxpayers but also educate our youth because our youth are our future taxpayers. We use innovative methods like interactive games, magic shows, slogan writing, street plays, etc. And we have invited many schools and we expect a good attendance from the schools themselves because we want to educate our future taxpayers about the responsibility of paying taxes. And as you all know, the youth are the future of this country. Now, apart from education, there will also be special kiosks erected to give information about various provisions of the Income Tax Act. Now, as you know, in Meghalaya, the tribals are exempted from income tax under Section 226 of the Act. But along with this exemption comes certain statutory compliances that have to be made to claim this exemption. As you all know, the income tax has used information technology in a big way. 
in order not only to improve taxpayer services but also to check tax evasion. Now everything income tax is done online. Now if you want to file a return, you can't file physically as it was done a decade back. It has to be done online. And in order to file a return, you have to register yourself in the income tax website. So in this taxpayers hub, there will be facilities also for new taxpayers to get themselves registered on the income tax website. Thus many people in Geelong are not registered on this website. Secondly, we will be also distributing brochures and pamphlets to educate the taxpayers, the taxpayers, especially the tribal taxpayers and the tribal population of their obligations under the Income Tax Act. You know, most of the grievance in Meghala as far as uh, tribal taxpayers are concerned and tribal SSEs are concerned are because of ignorance. The ignorance about the Act. The Income Tax Department has got a lot of information because they use data mining. We get information from the banks, we get information from the various authorities, the DTO. So we have a huge bank of information. And sometimes we want to verify this information that we receive. For example, if there are huge cash transaction or bank account, we would like to verify it. And verification is sent online. So we send it through email or we send it through uh, your SMS. Now most of the SSCs here they have not updated their email or they have not updated their mobile numbers. So some of the notices are not adhered to and as a result this leads to a lot of complications. So these are other issues uh, would be discussed and our team, the Income Tax Department, consisting of senior officials would be there to handle any queries that come from our taxpayers. Apart from that, there will also be a special kiosk for other uh, pedestal of grievances.